security breach. What? Not to be sarcastic, but you might be quicker if you just walk over there and knock on the door. It is 911 after all. It is. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, you're literally like 70 feet from. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll call the sheriffs and have them come over and check you out. Sure. Then. Yeah, you bet. I'll wait for them. Oh, it was you? Yep, it's me. Do you know him? No. Oh. He'll be out here the video and taking photos of the crash the building and whatnot. He can do all that. So, uh, do you have some kind of ID on you? He doesn't have to show you ID. Did you have a six pack of Freedom Juice before you showed up to work no. today? No. Man. County Maintenance Office. It's March 6, 2023. We do a public records request. How can I help you? Yeah, I'm looking to get a public records request form. Um, public re uh, PDR form. Where would uh, you get that? Clucknet? Well, I just need to get a, a physical copy. One of the options for citizens is to get a physical copy, fill it out, and deliver it back to the, the office they're requesting records from. Yeah, yeah, of course. But usually uh, uh, our office is would serve like other offices. Like if you were to get a record from like... I don't know. Uh, if you were able, if you were to get like get a record or request a record from C CCSO, you would go through them, and then they would come to us, and that's how it usually works. So um, sure, yeah. yeah. It's just when I read the statute and I looked at the attorney general's instructions, it says any government office I go to, I can get that from. So. Yeah, of course. Um, but we're we're more of a, a, a entity that serves other county office entities. So you are right, and so this isn't a government uh, agency. Um, no, we are. It's yeah. just a. a the way we serve the public is that is that that's the way we serve the public. No, I get it. I mean, you're talking about your policy as opposed to law, but the, just the way the attorney general goes over it, uh, on his instructions to government agencies. Yeah, is if somebody shows up and needs to do one in person, they can get the form from that building, that specific building and agency. Go fill it out and bring it back, and then you guys at that point, then you guys forward it on to whoever you do. Yeah, of course, of course, yeah, of course. So. so um, any way I could just get one printed out and then I could go fill it out with some coffee, get some coffee and then uh, bring it back. Is there it is the record center after all. Um, Hi. Oh, hey. How's it going? All right. Well, so what's the question? Uh, just looking to get a public records request form. I was going to go grab a cup of joe, fill it out and then bring it back. Well, the county is set up to have that done through an online portal. Yeah, it's a but, website. Yeah, but uh, one of the options is for people to do it in person. At least that's what the attorney general said on his uh, on his website. Right, there. I'm familiar with the yeah. attorney general's website. Um, the well, I just looked at at our web page, and I thought, well, maybe there's a form attached to the page, but there wasn't. So I'm not sure. Um, the only thing I could suggest is the county council office is the main point of contact. For the entire county. Where's the county council office? It's at? on the sixth floor of the large brick building there. Yeah, inside the county courthouse. No, no, no. This that's is the courthouse. This is the public service. That's center. public service center. Gotcha. Okay, so I can go in there with that. Is there any security in there? At the front, uh, at the front desk, they'll be able to direct you. Um, that's really the security. Uh, yeah, but you don't there. have to go through security to get into the building. There's right? not. There's not a. Um, like a security checkpoint or anything yeah. like that. You just walk right on in, okay. and so there's there's not a security in the sense of like the courthouse. You know, you have the yeah, metal detectors yeah, yeah, and whatnot. Exactly, yeah. There's no security in that sense. Okay, but right. there is someone uh, there that will be able to help you out the front desk. All right, cool. Well, I'll, I'll head over there then and talk to them. It probably just sounds like maybe the county attorney needs to have a conversation, which is different departments because. Uh, you know, having a focal point like that's pretty unhelpful. I mean, if you had someone who's disabled and it's more onerous for them to have to go to the attorney's office every single time, 
you know, rather than just going to an agency that's well, physically lo well, closer. Well, log logging on to the website should make it simpler for well, anybody sure, assuming you people have, have access. Your home. Yeah, assuming people have access to the internet. There's still a lot of people out there that don't. Or people who have uh, disabilities that don't allow them to use keyboards or speak to do, yeah. uh, you know, speech yeah. to text. Well, and I agree that there should be a physical form, and I'm surprised that there isn't one attached to the Yeah, website. and that's why I said I'm going to go over there. I mean, uh, it, it sounds like the higher-ups have sort of bamboozled you guys by not making that available to you guys, yeah. uh, and that's that's obviously just, you know, executive management needs to fix that, so I'll go take it up with them, and then maybe they can just do a better job at doing their job, so. Yeah, sure. All right, thanks. Yeah. What are you up to? Oh, just recording and taking photos. For? Oh, just personal use. Okay. Well, I don't know that you're supposed to be inside here. That's our 911 dispatch center. Oh, yeah. That's why I didn't go past the crest of personnel only. But yeah. Totally have not gone beyond there at all. Okay. The only place I've come in was from the gate. And I checked to make sure it didn't say that it was just only authorized vehicles. So I didn't drive in here. I just okay. walked in here. So. All right. Yep. Just uh, taking photos of the 911 center. Kind of interesting. I assume you work for the Clark County Facilities Manager? I do, yeah. Cool, all right. So, yeah, it just makes you a little curious when somebody's out taking pictures of this thing. Oh, it's a nice day. It's not actually raining today. Right. Good day for photos. I don't it think is. you can always uh, set the standard to be, uh, make sure it's warm and even nicer. You know, you kind of got to just take the non-rainy days. That just makes it colder and more yeah. miserable, frankly. So, uh, do you have some kind of ID on you to tell me what who you are? Oh no! In case something comes up. No, yeah, I don't carry ID. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll call the sheriffs and have them come over and check you out. Then. Sure. Yeah, you bet. I'll wait for them. All right. What was your name? Bob. Bob. Okay. Yep. I'm Steve. Yeah, I'll, uh, like I said, I'll just wait right here. I don't want them to think I'm running or anything like yeah, that. Yeah, it's not a good idea. No. Not in today's world. Yeah. No, for sure. Fortunately, I'm really obvious in my orange jacket. Sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I get it. It just makes you makes you curious. Sure. It's kind of a protected property, so. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I try to, you know, do my due diligence, make sure there's no authorized personnel only signs, that kind of stuff. That's why when I looked at that crest of personnel only, I made sure that, you know, I didn't go beyond that. So. Definitely don't want to go where I'm not supposed to. No. <laughs> so what do you do with the uh, facilities management? I, I uh, manage the maintenance crew for them. Oh, okay. So you're like the foreman, I guess. Yeah. All right. Been doing that long? Uh, 17 years. No, oh, that's a good clip. It's not too bad. Yeah. State retirement system in Washington State, from my heard, is not too shabby. Not too bad. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, if you, I mean, not to not to be sarcastic, but you might be quicker. If you just walk over there and knock on the door, it is 911 after all. It is. <laughs> <That> it is. <laughs> I mean, you're literally like 70 feet from it. I just go over and rap on the well, door. They, they don't. <laughs> well, they would call the sheriff. Isn't that kind of weird? I mean, do they call themselves? How does that happen? No, because all they are is dispatchers. <laughs> oh, okay, I see. Yeah. <laughs> I know I tried security over there. Oh, I'd probably answered. just be quicker to call 911, honestly. You know you're going to get a pickup immediately with that. Yeah, I'll call their non emergency. Yeah. <laughs> you're going to have to call emergency? I just get these big recordings. Ah. The phone trees. Gotcha. Yeah, I mean, ultimately, uh, if you don't want to hang around forever, I'm just, you know, in an authorized area taking photos and recording. But I mean, 
You want to get the sheriff over here? We can, we can wait. Yeah. I think it'd be in the best interest if for no other reason than just to find out who you are and what you're up to. Oh yeah, well they can't ID me for just shits and giggles. You know, gotta be a crime going on. So. Well, they might have a curiosity as to who you are and why you're oh, taking sure, pictures yeah. and photo in the dispatch center, so. Yeah. And given the fact that we've had, you know, some number one substations that have been vandalized and whatnot they're a little hypersensitive about stuff sure sure so i'm sure not against the law for you to be out here taking pictures oh no yeah yeah now the <coughs> first and fourth amendment they're pretty good i mean i like all 10 but the first and the fourth are pretty pretty dang decent pretty dang decent all right Michelle, big fan And recording. Building. And recording. He's right out here in our parking lot, so I just want him to send the, the uh, campus deputy over and see what he's up to. Awesome. Thank you. Bye. All right. They're going to send someone over? They are. All right. So is it going to be sheriffs or city? Sheriff. Okay. Yeah, we've got a uh, sheriff's deputy that runs this campus down here. Oh, okay. Just kind of like a designated dude who makes Campus. sure everything's okay around Campus here. Campus security. Yeah, it's for all the courthouse and the admin building, this building, a bunch of, you know, a bunch of the buildings. Gotcha. So, fair enough. Yeah. Miss Kirsten. Um, security breach. What? Oh no, I didn't go into your property, I promise. I never went beyond the first element. The supervisor said we had somebody filming or something, and so they were yep, concerned. That's me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Taking photos that's and recording. I called and had him <laughs> dispatch the deputy over. Did you? Yeah. We just see what's going on. Oh, it was you? Yep, it's me. Do you know him? No. Oh, and what were you videoing? Oh, just the 911 center. Are you videoing me right now? I am. For what reason? Uh, just my own reasons. I record everything I go and do during the day. So. Okay, you've got the WD over? It's supposed to be on his way. Yep. All right. So, yeah, one of the guys pulled in and said there was going to be out here photo, doing some photo shoot on the Crescent Center. So. Yep. Said, All right. Yeah, but definitely made sure. I mean, I took Let's took notice it. of your Crescent personnel only signs. So I didn't go beyond that. Yeah, I don't even have ID on me, actually. <clears throat> ah, there we go. Cool. There he is. My guys pulled in here for lunch and said there was somebody out here that was videoing and taking photos of the crest of building and whatnot. He can do all that. So there we I, go. I just wanted to double check. I asked him for some kind of ID. In case he doesn't have to show you ID. Okay. It's all good. It's First Amendment. I may yeah. have misunderstood Absolutely. that. Is that a SUV or is that a bald eagle that you rode in on? Because that's called freedom, people. You can record and photograph in public. First Amendment, sir. Sure. Woo! All right. Man, that's a lot of freedom around here. All right, guys, have fun back in the 911 building. Try not to calm yourself. No, I really, actually, could I get a, a business card? Yeah. Do you have one? Thank you. Woo! Clark County, loving the freedom around here. Jesus. Did you have a six pack of freedom juice before you showed up to work no. today? No. Man, I love it. Not my first day. Now, the job. why why is there such a difference between you guys and the city of Vancouver? They were wearing some really high polished, almost knee high boots earlier, <laughs> and I was like, man, 
Really nice hats. Kind of seem like I've seen them in a World War before, but I couldn't remember which one that was. Not real sure on that part. But <laughs> uh, I'm not going to try to trap you too much I'm on that I one. I was glad I was able to help you out. <laughs> you have a good day. You have a great day. Take care. <laughs> oh, boy. Look at that. Everybody's scattered. Woo! Love it. All right, guys. Well, I think facilities got title lesson so did 911 and that fantastic deputy is deputy jimmy rogan of the clark county sheriff's department excellent excellent job by the deputy